Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to League One Predictions. League One has literally, you know, had a big midweek full of games. Um, nearly every team played except one, obviously Drew's played Barry, but, um, but a few results going against the odds, a few results, you know, not going quite expected like a lot of people would have thought. Um, but guys, anyway, you know what I'm trying to do, try to get to a thousand subs, come May. Um, the best way you can do uh, to do it is by sharing my videos, letting people know about my channel, and let's see if we can do that together. Um, and let's see where we are come the end of the season. Um, but anyway, guys, you know what I do, so guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first game we're going to talk about is Accrington Stanley versus Gillingham. Accrington Stanley loses 4 0 at home to Peaceborough. Gillingham drawing 1 1 away to Shrewsbury. A disappointing day for Accrington considering they beat Ittridge on the weekend. Obviously, Peaceborough is a different um, team, different day. Di you know, you can never, I don't think two, two results are never the same anyway. Um, if you get one, if you get where I'm coming from, um, Gillingham, great point away to Shrewsbury. Um, you know, where's that guy favourite Gillingham coming the end of the season? We're gonna have to wait and see. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Bristol Rovers versus Portsmouth. Bristol Rovers, uh, Losing at home 2 0 against Bolton. Um, Portsmouth beating Lincoln, Lincoln City 1 0 at home. Um, as I said, great three points for Bolton. I want to talk about more about that and the Bolton point of view when I talk about the Bolton fixture. Um, but great three points for Portsmouth. Disappointing day for Bristol Rovers, um, you know, this weekend, this game, it's looking quite good. Um, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Burton Albion versus Blackpool. Burton Albion beating um, Wimbledon 1-0 at home. I don't think Wimbledon's got a fixture this week. Obviously due to play Berry. Yeah, as I said, you already know what's happened to Barry, so. Um, Blackpool 1 1 at home to Wickham. Disappointing day for Blackpool, as far as I'm concerned. Um, you know, as the farthest state of. You know, where they both teams are on the table. Um, great uh, result for Burton Albion. 1-0 winners um, at home um, against Wimbledon. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Burton Albion win. My next one is Fleetwood Town versus MK Dons. Fleetwood Town losing 2-1 away sorry, to Coventry. MK Dons losing 2 0 away from home to Watchdale. Disappointing day for both clubs. Um, probably more disappointed of the MK Don result. But I know how Coventry could play um, at St Andrews. So, you know, as I said, probably more disappointing on the MK Dons end. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 3 0 Fleetwood Town win for that one. My next one is Lincoln City versus Bolton. Bolton winning 2 0 away to Bristol Rovers. Lincoln losing 1 0 away from home to Portsmouth. Let's talk about this Bolton result. I'm one of them fans um, that don't want Bolton to go down. I don't think any team, you know, minus the point of the Dutch turn and everything else, 
I feel so sorry for the fans when they nearly all go into a liquidation. I don't think it should happen in the world of football. I think it's a disgrace if the owners let it happen. Um, and you know, don't be, don't come out saying that we're in financial trouble. You know, about two years down the line before the dead literally are in the way you saw Bolton. I'm so chuffed for them to get that first win after coming out of a liquidation. Um, you know, or nearly in a liquidation, but great three points for Bolton. Hopefully they can kick on now. And that sort of makes up for the weekend's result when they lost coming where they lost too. But you know, it makes it makes up for Bolton. Um and you know, beating Bristol Rovers 2 0 away, you know, that makes it a bit better as well, considering where Bristol Rovers are in the in the table. Um but yeah I'm very happy for Bolton um in that result. Link on the other hand losing one nil away to Port uh, to Portsmouth. You know, it's probably one of them days again with Lincoln. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Bolton win. My next one is Oxford United versus Rochdale. Rochdale, uh, sorry, beating MK Dons 2-0 at home. And uh, Oxford did not have a game. Um, I'm guessing that, you know, has played very. Um, but great three points for Rochdale. And, you know, considering that's the only result, I'm just going to give you the result over for this one. And I'll go for a 2-1 Oxford win. My next one is Peterborough versus Coventry. Peterborough beating Akron Stanley 4 0. Um, there's some high results in the midweek games. Um, Coventry beating Fleetwood 2 1 at St Andrews. Good three points for Coventry. Bit expected. Good three points for Peterborough. But the result I've gone with, with this one is a 1 0 scoreline for that one. My next one is Rotherham versus Wickham. Wickham won one away to Blackpool. Rotherham beating Itchridge Town 2 0 away from home. Great three points for uh, Rotherham. Um, great point for Wickham. But as far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2 0 Wickham win. My next one is Shrewsbury Town versus Sunderland. Sunderland beating Tramia at home 5 0. Yeah, that's not a misprint. Um, Shrewsbury 1 1 against Gillingham at home. Great point for Shrewsbury, already said that. Some of them look like I turned up on the night, um, you know, to get a result like that. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2 0 Sunderland win. My next one is Southend versus Itchwich. Southend loses 7 1 at home to Doncaster. Um, Itchwich losing 2 0 at home to Rotherham. 7-1. I can't get mad around that. Um, disappointing day for both clubs, but as far as this game goes, I'm going to call it a shock this week. Now, because of it, Ridge, uh result this week and the, pre like the previous weekend, I'm going to call this one a shock, and I'm going to go for a 2-1 South End United win. My last one for this week weekend is Tramia versus Doncaster. Um, just as you mentioned, Doncaster seven one winners away to Southend. Tramia loses five 0 away to Sunderland. Two big results between the clubs. If you put the two clubs together, Sunderland and Doncaster, that's twelve goals. Twelve goals between two teams. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna, um, you know, roughly see what happened 
do to play each other but as far as this result goes I'll go for a 3-1 Doncaster win but anyway guys you know what to do give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it subscribe for more thanks for watching ciao for now